Hi there, it's Matt Barlow here from Christians Against Poverty with Sophie as well, and we are joined with Chris and Patrick from Ren Collective. I'm a little bit starstruck because I listen to your music all the time, guys. Awesome. Ever since I heard you play with Shane Claiborne over at Halifax, I've been a big, big fan. Awesome. Just, just love what you guys do. Thank and you. Uh, how, you're at Big Church Day Out. We had some fun around the campfire last night. We did, yeah. We did, and obviously you're about to go on main stage. Mm -hmm. But just what do you love about this sort of event? You know, what we really love about uh, Big Church Day Out is just that it's the whole church getting together you know it's not limited to denominations or anything like that but it's just everybody can come everybody can worship in their own way there's so much variety in the music and so much variety in the way that we can worship so it's it's got a special place in our heart for sure Great, and there's lots of things going on at the moment. You've been promoting a campfire tour, haven't you? Um, so could you just tell us maybe one thing or one of the most exciting things about what God's been doing through you guys and through Rend as a, as a group at the moment? Sure, well, it's just been amazing for us to be able to get the opportunity to share the message behind Campfire. And the message behind Campfire is that, you know, the church is all about community. Um, we think there's no better picture of community and celebration than the campfire. It's kind of a place where we share our stories and our songs and our lives together in a really intimate way. We just had the opportunity to uh, to be able to bring that to the church and to see the church respond to that. It's been amazing. Yeah, that's great. One of the things I've just been reflecting for you guys, because, uh, you know, I love, I just love where you come from. You know, you're really kind of the message is everyone's important. There are no special people. You know, we just need to be community together and all of that. How do you work that out in the midst of the fact that, to be honest, you're one of the biggest names here. Everyone's excited about Ren Collective. You've been promoted all over the place. How do you work that out as just normal believers kind of working through the celebrity factor? Yeah, um, it's, it's a strange thing. Um, you know, I think as humans, we are, uh, naturally going to lift people up and uh, I don't not necessarily agreeing with that in, in, in the Christian world but I think our job is to just turn that praise or whatever it would be just right back to God and you know anytime we're talking to people and if people are saying you know love your music uh, and that sort of thing we, we really appreciate that but we all we just want to give the glory right back to him as, as soon as we can and yeah. um, just let everybody know that we are we could not be doing this without him he is the reason we are doing this and uh, it's just so central so it's really very little to do with us and everything to do with him Great, and then finally, just thinking, you know, we're here, we're CAP, we're fighting lots of poverty in the UK. Um, how does things like social justice come out in your songwriting or affect, you know, what is it you're trying to say and kind of get the message out there? Sure, well, I guess worship is always something that is so much more than, uh, than about singing. You know, singing is just a noise at the end of the day, but, you know, justice is a kind of worship that, that goes on after the songs are finished. And we think that worship can really inspire people to change the way that they approach, you know, other people, you know, to love their neighbor globally and uh, and locally. And I guess we, we just try to write those songs that inspire the church to, to be the kingdom of God, to be the church and to build his kingdom on earth. Fantastic. Look, I just want to say a massive thank you to you guys through your worship. We sing, we've started singing some of it in our church as well. It's so fresh. It's so inspirational. Uh, it just, it really, really is. And I just pray God's continued blessing on you. Thank you for your support of CAP as well. And just kind of the fact that you're kind of, uh, kind of with us and behind us on our mission to see the church being relevant in its society in all these issues. And uh, we'll let you go now because we know you've got a big gig on stage and uh, lo really looking forward to it. So see how it goes. Yeah, all the best, guys. Thank all you. Right, thanks. Thanks very much.